Here's a Samsung Smart TV. I'm gonna show you how to set it up step by step. Now this model here is the AU8000 with the Crystal UHD, but other Samsung TVs would have a similar setup process as well, especially if you're starting off with this screen here, okay? Now we can set up using our smartphone or we can do the remote control going step by step. I'm just gonna go ahead and go with the remote here. So I'm gonna move over to the right, remote control. I'm gonna click on OK on the remote here. Now on the screen here it says, all you need is the Samsung Smart Remote. Simply plug in and turn on the devices that you want to control with your Smart Remote. Then we will take care of the rest. When you're ready, we will move on to the next step. So from here, if you have anything you want to connect, you can, you can go ahead and do it that now. Um, a sound bar. Uh, for me, I have a PS5, but I'm not going to set that up until like later on. So plug in the devices that you want, and then you can go right here. Click on uh, auto setup and follow the instructions on the menu. Okay, for me, I don't have nothing to connect right now, but I'm going to connect the PS5 later. So I'm just going to go into retail mode. That's perfectly fine for me. And I'm going to OK it here. Now in here, select uh, usage mode. I have retail mode or I have home mode. I'm going to go with home mode here. The retail mode is basically if you want to set up for like an in-store demo. So we're going to go with home mode here going to go ahead and connect to our Wi-Fi network here. You can always use the Ethernet cable as well, but I'm going to do Wi-Fi. I'm going to enter my password into my Wi-Fi. And after you enter your password, you want to go down to where it says done right there. Click on OK on the remote. Checking wireless network connection. Success. I guess that was the right password. Smart Hub. Terms and conditions, privacy notice. You can go ahead and read through all these details here if you wish. And then if you want to agree to it, you can click it. Or for me, I'm good with agree to all right there. I'm going to go down to OK. Checking for updates. Found the update. Now it's asking me to install it. So I'm just going to go ahead and install it now instead of later. I'll go ahead and do this now. For me, it looks like this install is going to take about 10 minutes. All right, it's just about done. And once the update is complete, the TV will restart. Restarting now. Make the most of your screen with your Samsung account. So you can go ahead and sign in if you have an existing account. Or if you don't have an account, you can go ahead and create one now. Or you can go ahead and skip, and then you can sign in and create an account later if you wish. If you want to skip it, you just press right, or it says skip up there. Press right, okay? So for me, I already have an account, so I'm just gonna to go to use existing account. I'm gonna click on okay right there. Now it's asking me for my email, my password, which I don't remember my password, so what I can do right now, it says, or sign in with your mobile device slash PC. So I'm gonna go here via website. So I'm gonna click on okay there, and I'm gonna use my phone. I'm just gonna go ahead and use my phone and use that QR code, because I already have my password saved into my phone. So let me go to samsung.com right there. And I'm going to go ahead and sign in. I'm signing in now. Okay, it says signed in. Now automatically the TV will continue here now. It says that I'm signed in my account. I'm going to go down here where it says got it. Keep everything that matters. Save your settings and easily restore them when you reset, factory reset, or buy a new model. So if you want to back up, so then all your, your information is saved. And so if you do a factory reset or if you buy a new model, you'll be able to keep all your saved data, okay? So that's up to you, okay? You can go ahead and back up data. Or if you don't want to, you can just go to skip. It doesn't, it's up to you, okay? For me, I'm fine with backing up data. And I'm going to go down here and click on backup. Find your service provider, enter your location to find your service provider and set up faster. So what you can do is you can put your uh, zip code in, or if you want to skip it, you can just go ahead and skip it. Just press on the right. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and enter my zip code. And here's my zip code here. And now as soon as you put your zip code in, just go where it says done right there. Click on OK. And then from here, I'm going to go ahead and go with next. Use your voice to get what you want, and you can go ahead and select. You got Big, uh, Bixby, Amazon, Alexa, and Google Assistant. You can do that now, or you can do it later, or you can just choose later and never do it, okay? For me, I'm just gonna go with later. 
discover a faster way to link your apps, select your favorite services below, and I only have two, Amazon Prime or Hulu, then simply sign up or sign in using your mobile device or PC, okay? Now, I do have Amazon Prime, but for me, I'm just gonna go ahead and sign in uh, later on, okay? So for me, I'm just gonna go ahead and skip this for now. I have other apps that I wanna download as well. And then you got a little thing up there that says, uh, choose the apps that you would like. I mean, for me, I'm fine with everything just like this down here. I'm just gonna go ahead and click on save. You are all set, let's start watching TV. Okay, so for me, I'm all set up. Now I just have to sign in some of my apps. Uh, like I have subscription apps, like I use like Netflix. I'm gonna have to click on and sign in Amazon Prime Video. If you wanna download apps that's not currently on here, what you can do is just move all the way over to the left right there where it says apps, click on okay. And then from here, just go to the search. You can go to the search right there and then you can go ahead down here to find an app that you want, okay? So pretty simple. Any questions or issues, just comment below. All right, good luck guys.